welcome, and I'm so glad you're here. This is the Impra with Dungeon 4, and we're gonna play the Ethereal Christmas Tree Holiday Season Mission with all the holiday-looking visuals. And, um, yeah, I already played this, I already finished it, but there were some issues with recording, so I'm gonna try again. Let's get it recorded. I'm not playing on hardest difficulty. I tried, I failed, so medium will be plenty difficult for this mission. Let's see what we pick. Uh, this is what you get for the mission, Italia the glass cannon. I'm never gonna use this ever again. Absolute failure in my uh, opinion. The way I play is just a little bit too harsh. She dies too much is basically the issue. So I think we're going to go with... Um, Good question, honestly. I think we're gonna go with kamikaze minions. So we'll have undead and horde, maybe. Everything else stays as it is. So dungeon research reduction and master of traps. Let's get in it. Now, this skirmish mission isn't voiced. So I'll have to read the little things as they pop up. There's not too many. So let me just try and do that. Winter time, Christmas time. As every year, the elven Christmas tree was prepared and decorated by the people of Eversnow for the festivities. The tree is decorated by the heroes. Shipment after shipment of new tree decorations arrive at regular intervals. Try to intercept these shipments. When a shipment reaches the tree, it is then decorated and both the heroes and the tree are strengthened. As if that wasn't bad enough, powerful heroes then set out for the dungeon. Right. So we start with zero research on this and we'll get what we can get early. Gold is an issue in this mission. Up here in the north, that wolves, part of this uh, little thing here. And we'll have to try and venture out as quickly as possible. I'm going to focus the research on Horde and only unlock undead so far as we want to get the prison. Because we need to be a little bit focused. It's not so much of an evilness issue in this mission. It is really more a gold issue. So dividing your attention between two different research trees is going to be a little bit problematic for you in terms of resource management. So let's open this up for a vault of evilness. And this is the winter decorations here. You got some snow on the dungeon heart. Can't be that hot then. The swirling beneath is a little snowstorm. And we got a little snowman here, which I really appreciate. It's kind of cute. So slapping the snots about makes sense now. We'll upgrade a little bit more, just so we get them going. We did the first upgrade for the snots, so they speed up a little bit more when being slapped around. Which is a huge difference between the regular slap motivation and this. Uh, there's spiders around and all kinds of creepy crawlies. Some manavores will appear, some lavalums are about as well. So one thing we definitely want to do is uh, join up all the enemy routes. So we have a little bit of an easier time getting them to where we want them to be. So we'll link up these and these basically. I think this is the safest route to link through. I don't I don't believe there's actually anything there. So we're gonna dig through here. I don't think there is anything bad. We'll we'll try and go as far over as we can. We do hear some creepy crawly. So maybe there's a spider nest or so I forgot about, but we'll try and get as far as we can over here. And then build out like that. So Vault of Evilness is done. Let's build a little chamber for horde creatures. So we'll get that, we'll get this, 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 all of these immediately, right away. 
and the goblet farm because that's what we need to make them happy and we'll build out like so as well as you can hear there's spiders somewhere there in the dark all not a problem got some gold lying around here let's throw that into our chamber and let's motivate our little workforce some more here including this guy and help with the gold pickup So first we start with the goblet farm because that takes a little bit to generate the little creatures. Which we then need to feed our horde characters, our horde creatures. <clears throat> Alright. So far so good. Let's build a horde uh, sitting room. <laughs> basically and we'll upgrade into this so we can get this early we want the arena as early as we can but we do need some creatures so let's get some cheap orcs and we'll dig out the gold that we can find here already we can always fill it back in but as I said gold will be a scarcity issue here. Let's pump them s some more. There is a good vein over here, which is pretty safe to get. You just follow this line north. But right here, we just want to dig out the gold. Now, which entrance the enemy comes through is very. It varies. So you can't rely on them only going through one entrance. Let's get a Naga or so. I think we need to increase the size of this immediately. And we could prep an, an arena room. Discovered in your dungeon. So they can train early because experience is going to be a bit of a problem as well with how strong the enemy is. Alright, so we dug out all this, meaning we can pick up this. We can fill in some here. And we can fill in this. So that way the enemy will have to walk around our stuff. There's another gold right there that we could pick up. I hear some spiders. Oh, there's some brimstone. That might be interesting to pop. Just to force the enemies into a certain direction. And now we can start digging in this route. Like you can see how far we basically have to go to get around here. It's a bit of an issue. Okay, now let's take a lot of this away again. Basically all this yellow stuff we don't need. And we don't want all of this dug out either. So let's just destroy all this in terms of work orders. And we need to start destroying all these work orders. I mean, this is a room we can use for our arena, for sure. But we don't want it too much bigger. Let's get another Naga. Upgrade as well, so we can get uh, some goblins. Though I think we're space wise already constrained again. And we stop all this digging here. Just kind of want to go there. Uh, 
And I think we might need to fill this in. I'm a little bit afraid that if we dig around here. A spider room. Okay. Now we need to cancel all this. Otherwise our snots keep running into it. And we for sure don't want that. Oh. Let's help the little buggers. So they don't have to run so far. <clears throat> Let's cancel some more. Just so we're smart about where we're going here. And we can start new dig orders around here as stuff becomes relevant. So can we afford a bit of an arena? Yes, but we're gonna financially cripple ourselves for a little bit. So let's give them some motivation to work a bit quicker. We could attack these. And I think, in fact, we should. Get some experience early. And we'll want to upgrade this as soon as Your possible as well. Are in the dungeon. Okay, so they come from the north, which is a bit of a problem because that's just a straight line to the heart at the moment. We need to stop this digging. What we could do is dig in from here. Okay. That's not great. Talia did. And we might need to move soon. The main problems here are the assassins, honestly. Okay, we have to move now. Reason assassins are a problem is that they start hurting everything, including our little goblins, which are actually hidden. So our healers are just kind of confused on what to heal. Okay, great, yeah. Walk into my way there, please. Yeah, it's, it's always assassins, really. That are a bit of a problem for us. Just the AoE damage is the, is the real issue. Alright, we managed without greater losses. Okay, now we need to build a little workshop. We'll just add it here because then we can dig out this later once this is emptied out. And just go in there. And we'll fill in this. But we'll eventually want to link up all that. Speed, please. Speed. So one shipment is going to go through early. There's almost nothing you can do about it. Exhausted. The enemies are a little bit too strong for it. For you to do anything about it early on. Like if we if we go up there, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you real quick. If we want to intercept it, we have to go this way. But the very first groups here already contain... Okay, this one doesn't contain anything golden, but they very soon do. Let's upgrade that so they can le reach level 3. Upgrade our creatures as well early, quickly. Get them nice and strong. So there's no assassins in this group, meaning we can take on a little bit of a bigger group, honestly. Some level up happening, which heals. Let's research some doors. 
so we might be able to intercept this shipment. We'll try for sure. And we'll just focus down the assassins. If we can. Please let me select my orc. Nope. Too slow for the micro. You have lost a creature forever. Yeah, I'm aware. Okay. Okay, goblins. That's not very smart what you're doing there. Gotta kite a little bit. Okay, I think that was all our orcs did. Pretty much. Little snots have completely mined out a gold vein. Okay, we managed barely. And we lost all our gold downstairs, so we are in a big bind right now. A very big bind because we need to start excavating a new gold mine. See it right there. There is where it is. You can be fairly generous in digging this out. There's nothing around there that's super dangerous. And we can't research anything right now because we just don't have the gold, really. It's our main, if not only, issue. Day, creatures are collecting their pay. Gotta survive that payday. Now what we could try, and I think we should as well, we dig out this. Your enemies are in the dungeon. Okay. So there's another spider nest here. I kinda want to connect these up, you know. And we need to build that workshop. Your little snots have dug into a spider nest. Yeah, that's okay. Now we attack this spider nest here. Let's keep the monsters in check. Make sure to pull out anything that might die, like Cascadash there. But it seems we're doing well. Got to keep the enemy in mind, of course. Maybe it's enough for a level up, but I'm slightly scared it might not be. Come on, kill that big spider. It's really, you're lacking damage. Okay. Now we can go here. And immediately we pull out Talia because she's getting bonked the very first. And I'd rather her not get bonked to death. So we can go slap target the enemy here. But that usually brings the enemy into our back line. Because we spread out like this. 
So that's a little bit annoying. But I believe we managed. We did not kill the gold spider. Not yet anyway. So let's go take care of this now. And we can get some gnomes. Though they're not... They're not that great really. Um, we need to dig this. We need our snots to be a little bit better. We need to be able to dig through stone. Let's clean up those spider nests. Speed these guys up a bit. And then we can connect this place up over here. First we dig out all the gold. increase our gobbler farm somewhat and also empower our creatures honestly like that's something I, I tend to forget about a little bit it's very important let's boost these quarry stone very important to get I think the rest I want to leave a little bit and now we go up again and we're gonna go here and clear out some of these holdouts here with what we got I mean they're all level 3 now so that's pretty good we have some upgrades already to them so there's a little bit of damage in this army yeah, it's always the assassins Bigger goblin farm. Let's give this thing a door so it's a little bit more efficient. Same for the goblin farm. Let's make it more efficient. Payday. Okay, we can dig this out, honestly. We don't need that wall. Alright, and there's the next thing that we can take immediately. Which we will have to fight through to get to that caravan anyway. I never, ever, ever, ever get to select my boys when there's enemies there. You always select something else. It's just... Like, why... Why would I even want to select the dead enemy game? spread through the absolute evil's dungeon. It vowed that in future it would eat fewer flatulence-inducing vegetables. Okay, upgrade so we can get to level four with these creatures, and we'll take this down. It might not be super ideal because we're kind of fixing to get that caravan, but we have another chance to get it from there. We'll see. Um, Naga ceiling extra on orcs. Perfect. I'll take it. Now there is definitely enemies sitting around here somewhere. Right there. We'll just concentrate on the assassins. Might be losing some goblins. All of our goblins we might lose. Enemies have entered the dungeon. And we have enemies in the dungeon, so. 
Okay, we didn't lose a single goblin. Okay, they're coming from the north again, our enemies. That's a problem for us, of course. Okay, we have to use our teleporter. To protect the dungeon heart. Except the enemy is actually going for a gold chamber, which is... You know, not ideal, but... Let's get Talia out of there. She's immediately dead otherwise. Are we losing creatures? Yes. Okay, I think we managed to mitigate. Alright, um... Yeah, I don't think we're gonna catch the enemy caravan. There are too many enemies along this route here. So some of these will just... You don't get much of a choice. They, you have to let them go. Kinda. Uh, let's upgrade. Pains me to make these choices, really. We haven't built a single floor trap yet. Um... Make our orcs more resistant. Get some potions going. Quicker healing. Ah, oh, it's difficult. I think we'll go with the higher faction research, honestly. Level five. That makes a difference, for sure. And they can train here, so... Okay, let's dig out this. And then fill in this stuff. Right there. And then we need to start leading these here around as well. There's a big, big, big spider nest somewhere there. So leading the enemy through here would be good. So again, we'll go as far as we can. There's some gold right there. Just remember there's dwarves somewhere here in the north. I think we can even hear them. I think they're coming. It's a bit of a problem for us. Get some doors on the dungeon heart, maybe. The other directions are really fine. Can't pick up that gold, but that's okay. Okay, why can't you fill this in? What's your problem here? This is all open. Should be able to fill this in. Ah, because this is already filled in there. It's payday. Oh, perfect. We'll take that, thanks. You have unearthed a new area in the dungeon. Yep. We sure have. Okay, time to get a little bit funky here and get some other creatures in. I'm thinking demons, just some imps, you know, help out, hit the enemy back line. They are expensive, but they're a good complement to a horde. So, we'll need more goblet space. And we'll need somewhere to resurrect our lads, so just build this out here. I need to 
fill this in as well. Otherwise, they're just gonna go through there. Okay, we're gonna stop this. We're as far north as I'm willing to go right now with how things are. So the spiders are over there, that's nice. Let's build more goblet space. Beat our boys. Oh. So now we have one little spider nest helping us, basically, which is pretty nice. And we're building all the way around. Mainly to funnel in the dwarves, basically. That will be coming. So we should build a trap route somewhere here. Starting there. All this will be trap route. And we'll send out the enemies here so we can fill this you slot have discovered in. discovered a number of lava lumps. Yeah, okay, that's a bit of a problem. Okay, let's build toward there from this side. I don't know if we're going too far with this. Like you can hear them. They're, they're there. They exist. They are not a fancy. At least our horde creatures are nicely training, so that's good. What could we research? Increase these guys. Let's give the demons a little buff. Ooh, succubi. I think we'll go for that. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Okay, so they came through a golden gate. And we have dug toward the dwarves too far. Let's speed this guy up. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Okay. Not super ideal. But it might be fine. We just turned the tank with our succubi. A new area of the dungeon has been discovered. And if we can force the enemies to go through the lava lumps. Oh. Can I pick all these up? Creature regenerates 1% of itself. Let's just give it to one of those orcs. Another one for an orc. I think I saw an orc just die. I'm not quite sure. One what is this? Dug into a lava Payday brings mana. Uh, money. Yeah, that's not good. It's Payday. Men okay, all right. Have been discovered in your dungeon. Yeah, okay. So now we can fill this in. So if the dwarves come, they're going to go through the lava lumps. And these are fierce protectors. But we for sure have to dig this out. Uh, let's stop all this building here. And just continue there. So the enemy has to go through here. That's fine. That's fair enough. We might actually open this up. No, we're not. Force the enemy through the whole point. Now, stop it.
A new area of the dungeon has been discovered. Okay, we need to we need to deal with these mana wars here. It's a bit of an issue. Okay, lava lumps are being sent as well. I don't actually know where they're going. I think they're going to this end because I can't fill it in yet. So we do have to contend with them now. But there is a slim chance, very slim chance, that the lava lumps are actually going to fight the enemy. Like, maybe we are, we are lucky and they come in at the same time. That would be pretty cool. Manivores have appeared in your dungeon. Oh yeah, they do. They do do that. Okay. We have to fight the lava lumps. He already is a regenerator, and he's still being taken down so hard, it's crazy. I think we're good on our trap rooms. On our trap route, rather. So everything should be funneled in here now. Let's build a few traps. And let's go upstairs. Take care of a little bit of uh, enemy concentration right outside our gates. So we are not going to be... Having any difficulties trying to catch those things those patrols okay yeah cool just bulk up on the things that do area damage that's great okay we lost two imps one of your creatures has bit the dust I don't know what we lose Maybe an orc? Not so sure, honestly, what we lost. Let's just kite a little bit. There is a patrol coming. Actually, we lost two creatures. And I never built that imp resurrection chamber. So let's put these guys here. Let's build this thing, finally. And let's... Uh... Naga's healing beam can spread. That's very good. Indestructible, let's get it. Let's just pump these orcs. And... Buy a Naga orc and a... Goblin. And throw them upstairs. They're all level 1, of course, but... It's payday. Better to have them than not when the enemy arrives right now. I'm hoping that's a halfway decent spread. So these guys we can already position over there.
Hello? Attack, please? No! Come back. Okay. Good. So we're gonna take the small creatures first. No, no. Wrong. Enemies but. are in the dungeon. Okay, see? Something tried to get through here. Got completely obliterated. And we managed up here to con convince this caravan on discontinuing its journey. I don't think we can make it up here though. There is like big turrets. We can make it to that thing though. So we should take it out. So the Man of Wars here are going to do a pretty decent job at defending us, I think. Uh, the Lava Lumps. But an army of Lava Lumps is set itself on the way right now to come to us. Okay, we lost an Imp. I didn't manage to select it in time. And maybe try and kite a little bit. What the heck are you guys doing? Enemies have entered the dungeon. Yeah, they sure have. So the lava lumps, they can get just go through, basically. Oh no. Let's upgrade the Vault of Evilness, just in case. I don't want to leave any evilness lying around here. Okay, now we can go back down to help defend the dungeon. I wonder if they're going to attack that portal as well. I do not know that. So I do want them to come closer. I want to fight with my traps. Ideally. They te keep falling from stop to go. It's a little bit annoying. Okay, now we can start attacking. Let's get this going because we need to. Upgrade that further. Get the imps a little bit more power. And let's build that brewery, shall we? Now we can't actually dig through here because we never filled this in. But now we can. And we can build a brewery here. Doesn't have to be super big, like that is going to be plenty. Okay, let's get them down here so they can rest for a second and our enemies are coming through and they are indeed trying to take down that uh, portal so that's super ideal for us that's a really good uh, distraction for enemies coming through the north Pendant. honestly Creatures are we might want to head. figure out a way of forcing everyone to go through here uh, if we open up this and close that everyone has to go around here and if we dig out this And that's pretty good for us, I'd say. Okay, 
and with our traps, not beside our traps. Is where we want to fight. Very good. That worked out decently. Up here, they just... It's gonna take forever for them to get through there. What we can already open up is... Uh, want the enemy to go like that. We're gonna lose a little bit of area here. But that's okay, your, we can just use that to build something. Exhausted. So that's a problem for us. There really isn't any more gold here. And I think in this direction here, we're gonna have to fight some lava lumps. But we'll just go, yeah, around here. I think that's lava lump territory. Or not. I think there was some non-lava lump stuff. See? This is ideal. Tiny little army being sent. If it's even an army being sent, I don't know. Might not be. Okay, and now we can Look fill this in. The definitely never to appear world of dungeons. An MMO and with the this. budget of a small country. Waddle through the underground as a little snot and get a beating from a huge hand of terror. Mm, now that's And then we can like dig fun. out this stuff to build some sort of room. <laughs> I don't I don't quite know what yet, but it's gonna be a room. There are enemies in your dungeon. Why can't I fill this in? Now I can fill it in because there wasn't a way through. Basically. Very good, little snot. You just did it in time. So these are coming from the north. Those are not a big problem for us. We do see two caravans though, which is a big problem for us. Because at least one of these we should try and intercept. So let's go do just that. Let's see if we have the time. Dungeon has been discovered. I tried. Can't say Enemies I didn't try. Enter the dungeon. Tried to pull them out of danger. upgrade this give them a boost and build a brewery a if... has been mined out oh my god with our very last gold okay everyone payday I think we have the time the lava lumps are still being slowed and everything and these might just catch up to each other. Okay, everyone 
us down so we can go fight here. All right, let's build a little gold thing here. I know there's gold over here, but there's also big spiders. So I think we're gonna excavate into the spiders. So maybe the enemies will fight them. Definitely the lava lumps and the heroes are just fighting right now. So that's pretty ideal for us. Uh, we're not gonna get that second shipment. That's a lost thing. And that's two groups on that portal now. So I think... The portal is lost, which isn't bad for us. Because we can just kind of dig around here. Close that off and take this gold for us. We'll figure it out. Let's go higher on the faction research because I would like the snot to be not perceived as enemies. That'll help us a bunch as well. Sadly, they're getting that portal now. I mean, they're doing us a favor, really, but... So I'm Your pretty sure... Spider. Yeah, that's the spider we wanted to dig up. Oh. oh, I think I just saved him. Just barely. So hopefully, some of the enemies are going to see the spiders. Not these. But everything that comes from the south might just. And then they're gonna fight there. I don't know where this guy is going. I don't like it, yo. I can tell you that. Okay, everyone's training a little bit. Very good. And now we fight on our traps. So we can send them around here. Straight over there, basically. Then we can fill this in. One of your Take some of that out. Died. What? <laughs> Darn. Oh, we have a little bit more space anyway. Let's get a few more succubi, I think. Let's get another naga and definitely more imps. We have very few imps. I think if I dig this out, the northern heroes might just see the spiders as well. Okay, cool. No, we're not gonna dig anything here. I don't know why this was selected. Did I do that? Probably. Must have been. No one else can select that for us. You see why we need that snot upgrade? You see this? Just horrible. So we can build a little treasure chamber here. And then we can start digging this out. Now that there's no more lava lumps, I don't really think we need this. Payday. Could just Creatures reclaim some of the dungeon, you know. Alright. 
well cleaned up. Let's throw these there. Manavors have appeared in your dungeon. Oh yeah, that's Okay, that is a problem. I did decide not to go here, so. So the Naga, they tend to stand on the lava and just heal each other forever. <laughs> that is, of course, not great. So these are going around there. And if we just put the entrance to this here and fill in this entrance, then they will see the spiders inevitably. So the enemies can take care of the spiders for us, really. Okay, for a second I thought I didn't fill this in properly. And I was a little bit scared because they were beelining right for the heart. Yeah, suboptimal. Pick up all that mana. No. Okay, fine. Let's pick up some of that gold. Throw it there. Honestly, actually, that's not the worst idea. If we pick up that gold here, they have more room to dig it out there. Actually, not the worst idea. But I wanted the mana to just move that out of the way a little bit. Alright, very good. That worked out. So now they are fighting the spiders. And we can rescue our little snot buddy. That's working out beautifully for us. Enemies have to walk. Redistribute the wealth a little bit. Alright, let's get the snot upgrade so they are no longer a threat to the enemy. And let's boost our lads up here a little bit. The brewery is working. We're getting some in. We'll have to take care of the needs of our demons soon. Let's not forget about that. This is all out war up here. But better them than us, is what I say. So we have a healer in this. But only one assassin, so... Let's get in here. I don't like how they bunch up like this. This is... Very impractical. Let's get our super fragile imps out of there. They can attack from here, no problem. Okay, I think they took care of the spiders. They sure did. So that's a lot of enemies now. But, we get full access to all of this up here. And that's like the biggest gold in there. There's some more over here. Ding dong, it's payday.
Let's hope these are level 4s not building here right now. They are, I think. What else should we get? I think another succubus. That might have been what died. Okay. Not sure if this is gonna work out right now. Succubi like to go right in there. Okay, just caught Talia in time. Okay, we have to go a little bit back because that one assassin they won't attack him because they see the other enemies one of your creatures is furious and is on strike okay so why are you guys on strike though okay now the assassin is dead you have beer what else do you want you have pay you have beer I don't know why they're angry. Oh god, we're losing stuff, aren't we? Yep, all of our Your imps are dead. Are in the dungeon. Because they insist on going way, way, way too close to the enemy. Like, what's your problem? Why are you on strike? How do I see that? Why are you on strike? Rest? 100% need? Oh! Oh, I don't think they have beds. Let's remedy this. <laughs> I don't think they have beds. That's the problem, of course. We'll need to upgrade our uh, traps a little bit. And build more, of course. Okay, and now we build the treasure chamber up here. So these guys don't run around forever. And we build some doors. Enemies are in the dungeon. Sadly, there's no more cool enemies we can send our enemies toward. Okay, let's build a bigger bedroom. So everyone can actually get some rest. And not have to double up on the bunks. Yes, 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 you are right. Excuse me. I did you dirty here. So I don't like how we keep fighting like this. So we're going to build this line. So we can drop creatures right there. And then they will see the enemy and engage from that end. Rather than walking around here and then bunching up like that. We need the teleportation thing for us, not... This is not economical what we're doing. Okay, so the enemy has a golden portal right there. That's a bit of an issue for us. 
Um. Payday. Okay, we're gonna build another route through here. So we have a space to attack them from. Basically. We could go from up here, but then I destroy kind of this trap route. No one's gonna go there anymore. Your gold vein is nearly exhausted. Which one? I can just pick up that bit gold that's sitting around here. Okay, that's a lot of enemies coming in. If we fill this in, just this bit, and we go get this research, then we can put one of those wheels here, and we still get our little attack room. Lady. How about you don't go there? Okay, we have two caravans coming in because I have not been paying attention to the overworld for even a second at the moment because honestly, this is very worrying. Now, our traps aren't nearly strong enough at the moment. So that's a bit of an issue. Your little snots are completely mined out of gold vein. Which one? Oh, we're working on this one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's that's fine. Look at how much is coming. Okay. Proof of uh, concept now. And I think we want more slime traps this way. Yeah, this works much better now. Let's get these and attack from behind. Like, she's dying to the trap for sure. But might as well get someone out of the line of fire here. There are enemies in your dungeon. What is dying, this guy? We don't have a resurrection chamber yet, so I'd rather they don't die. So enemies in the dungeon will remain a problem for us. Until that golden gate is shut. And for that we will have to attack the dwarves. But we're working on it. It doesn't really matter how many traps we got going here. Dungeon, unicorn bone toothpicks will now be handed out with every gobbler. And we can just take all this gold and put it into a chamber a little bit closer to home. Like so. Enemies have entered the dungeon. And we could also fight here. That's also a nice little line we got. And we just engage these from behind. Oh, very good. That's lovely. Kick that in there.
Payday! Creatures are collecting their pay. Okay, that's a bit of a big thing. Are we fine or not? Now we're gonna pull back. We're gonna fight in here instead. Like, the way I built it, they have to walk around here. That's perfectly fine. I don't want to fight all of them at all the same time. Like, that's just not economical. Just not good for us. Maybe, maybe Talia, you don't go there. So now we can fight the dwarves a little bit. Just go here. I hope we attack the door. Okay. It's not ideal. Just attack from the side here. The enemies are surely keeping up, holy heck. Where it's those tanks. Oh, that's a nice chunk of evilness. Just want to kill that heart there. Okay, and now we go attack these fools right there. So the Dwarven Heart taken? I don't know if they rebuild that. I sure hope they can't. I don't think they can. But I wouldn't be so sure. Let the enemy come a little bit more. Don't be so hasty to fight. But we're pretty good on resources right now. So let's do some research. Bump these up fully. Get a resurrection chamber. I think I would like that. I'm still very scared for our boys. But bumping these up fully. Orc champion. And Naga champion. Sure would be something. Let's go with that first. And we can still bump the goblins. And we can increase the training room a little bit. So that's all our money for the moment. Still a whole lot of dwarves. Let's get these chambers cleared out a little bit. <laughs> Oops. Bit too much. Okay, yeah, you can fight these. It's not much. Let's build the door so efficiency increases. Same for this thing. And 
and resurrecting more quick generation for the demons. Sure, we can use that. We need mana pools and all that kind of stuff, so we will have to go north. Uh, up, actually. Not north. So we'll break through here, take that, uh, take that door. I think. Should be fine. I don't really care to get the di diamond vein. I don't. Ding dong! It's payday. Though taking out that portal would be nice. And I think we'll try. I mainly want to go take that portal, really. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Why are you guys dying? Like, really, seriously, why are you guys dying? Okay. So that's taken care of that portal. And we could take care of these dwarves. What's this here? Oh, more dwarves. Let's go. Come on, buddy. Help out. So now we can work on this. Sure, have your payday. There's some more dwarves back here though. Until we have cleared these out. We're not safe. Okay, but there are... Okay. Caravans. Let's go take some of these, honestly. You can just get your money up here. That's fine. Let's try at least get some of these caravans. I mean, there's three coming. There are enemies in your dungeon. Okay, I think our army is doing fine. Oh, hey, we lost a succubus. We need this. So we can start generating and storing mana. Okay, we're healing enough to offset these now, so that's nice. Question is, can we intercept another shipment? I don't think so. So let's go back down. Defeated. And sad. <laughs> because we're for sure not being able to kill that. Let's give this room a little bit more power. Definitely higher level there. And I wanted to get the mana bath. Ah, fool. I am a fool. So wasn't I building something weird up here? Yes. Definitely our mana room then.
Okay. Um. Please, enemies, turn around. Thank you. No idea where she's going. I doubt she knows where she's going. Let's upgrade some of these lesser expensive things. another one of these all right there's another army coming uh, let's just give them the payday let's go boys hoover up that coin there these armies do get expensive don't they and now we attack from our attacking position again. I don't care about these dwarves. They're never going to move anywhere. They're protecting a little bit of gold, but... On gold, we're kind of fine for the moment. Let's go upstairs. Let's take care of these dwarves here. Let's upgrade here so we can get better traps. the dungeon dwarven tanks are really crazy okay we have a golden gate down but that's i think we can deal with it let's try and take out the hero hole oh god dwarves so so many dwarves oh this might be a bad split for our army Oh, boy. Move, please, let, please. Oh, God. Okay. We just got a patrol spawned here. Okay, uh, we're gonna lose a bunch of troops up here. Yeah, you have lost that was forever. horrible. There are enemies that was dungeon. really, really bad. Oh, man. That makes me a little bit sad. Completely useless. Completely pointless loss. Not, I'm not saying it was avoidable. Because you can't really know when they're going to spawn new enemies, but that hurt me in my very little soul. That made me very sad right there. Oh, God. Okay, then. All right, now. Yeah, we have to deal with that portal. So let's go fight that portal first. Let's just take it out. Let us fight those dwarves. They are very easy. Nothing ever came through the south, south, south door. Do 
Just pick up a little bit of experience is what I'm doing. For the level 1 creatures that we just got. Same over here. We'll just fight a bunch of spiders. I'll be per perfectly fine. They just need that little boost. That's all. Do have a bunch of level three snots. Not a big fan of that. Payday. Not a big fan of that. So that is of course a drawback. By funneling every enemy through the same range, basically. <laughs> Inevitably, you will have large groups bumping up. And that of course can be a bit of an issue. As long as our tanks can do tanking and our little goblins can clean up the healers, we're pretty decent here. And caravans are coming soon. Okay, our goblins are not managing. The enemy just keeps healing. Oh, we might be... We might be having a little bit of a problem here. I mean, there's a good chance more will die down in that trap tunnel. Until they get around here. So maybe we just do wait. Let's kick them down here for the moment so they can resurrect, regenerate, whatever. Yeah, you can see see a bunch of healers are dying here. But that's fine. Our level 2 snot, can you please not exist there? Like, there's so many standing around there, just go there. Be part of that group. Okay, that wheel was entirely pointless. We have to fight them here now. There's nothing we can do. But it looks like we managed... Wasn't even that bad in this instance here. Let's kick everyone down here again. I would like to pick up the evilness. No, that's not evilness. But sure. There we go. So we don't have anything right now that helps us build evilness up. Uh, torture chamber would be great. But we need this now. Could upgrade that. Could upgrade this. Resurrecting demons cause less evilness. Let's do that. Huh. Okay, let's build them a bath somewhere. Here's the resurrection chamber. Gobbler farm might need to increase still, so... Let's just build them a bath here. It's kind of quiet over there. Doesn't have to be super big. 
and the tavern is fine as it is. So the tree is at 60%. I do kind of want to go up. These guys are standing around a bunch. So let us. Might as well not stand around. When they start moving again, we can still return. But let's try another push for this thing. And this time maybe we keep our army together and don't split it into two factions that then compete for damage. Or rather compete for being killed. Stanley was wondering whether he should return to his desk. Oh sorry, I'm in the wrong script. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Alright, so now we can take the hero hall out. And we pulled this army, and we got a third one. Ding dong! It's payday! Just wasn't feasible, is all. Let's go attack these fools here. Let's upgrade this so Talia can actually go to level higher. <laughs> Um, upgrade our goblins, get some of that, some spells for sure. So now we can get Gorgu, which is pretty much needed to win this mission. Are we still being attacked? Yet yeah, there is this assassin with like half a health. Okay, so going around here is a problem because these turrets, they just kind of shoot down there. Let's upgrade our goblins. Oh no, we... Shouldn't have upgraded the goblins. Because now we don't have the evilness that I require to do the thing I wanted to do here. Oh, man. Let's intercept this caravan, maybe. Maybe we can actually manage this. Our enemies are a little bit preoccupied, as it looks, so... Okay, the dwarves are also coming. One of your creatures has become livid with rage. Enemies are in the dungeon. All of these guys are dead. All our demons are dying. Can I please select my own units? I see the enemy in the dungeon, but I'm making a conscious choice not to engage. Let's pull this guy out. One of your creatures has become livid with rage. Like, what is your problem, mana bath? Did I not build that yet? No, I didn't. So we have to go back down. I just built the room for it. I never built the bath. <laughs> there you go. Now you can have your bath. Isn't that nice? Okay. Let's improve our traps. Ah. I never know what to pick.
Yeah, okay. I'm not so sure if I'm happy with my choices, but... Speaking of not so happy with my choices, okay, these fools are just gonna slowly walk here. Good stuff, good stuff, yeah. Mm -hmm. Great. So this one army is still stuck. They still don't quite know what to do with themselves. I mean, imagine this on hard. I tried, I really did, but... I'm barely holding on on medium. The way I play. I know there's many ways to play this. I know you could do it so much better. And if you do... Man, so proud of you. Okay, is everyone back down now? Almost. Oh. Okay, now I can get everyone up here. And you guys can go have your bath now. Is that not fantastic? Maybe let's build a door through here. Okay, we're losing a lot of snots there. For no good reason, but... They will respawn, they will replenish. I really don't know what happens if this reaches 100%. But they're very close Ding to it. Dong, it's payday. They're very close to it. So we need 200 evilness to fight in the center. Without Gorgo, we're not gonna manage it. Like, there's literally no chance. Trust me on this one. Okay. We're gonna go fight these. Like so. It's mainly assassins, so I hope we're good. I don't know where all of these are going. Oh, of course. Oh, yes. Yes, attack. Attack the trees. Mm-hmm. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good. Great choices. Great choices all around. Okay. So we're gonna take all these, throw them upstairs. This way they get insta-paid. And we can try and push in here. We're gonna get the good creature there. We're gonna take down baby Yagi's uh, tavern. For the evilness that we need to summon Gorgu and then we're just gonna push in inside and, and finish this. I think we've done this long enough now. And we actually can get in there now. Because Gorgu pretty much is gonna clean up with that. I don't care. The imps are gonna clean it up. Oh, there we go. And we can also summon our friend here your little snots have completely mined out a gold vein enemies have entered the dungeon i'll just send him right on this maybe i don't even know if he can die honestly but we'll just attack that tree your army has just decreased in size yep. due to death there we go <laughs> if you want to finish this just use gorg uh, that's uh that's how I've been doing it. I I forgot to read the thing. But we managed. Finally. 
and I did actually properly record it this time. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I think this is going to go up before the 23rd. So if it is, no, actually it isn't. I think it's going to go up on the 23rd. But if you're catching this right now over on the YouTubes on the 23rd, I'll upload it about the same time. So when this video releases, we're doing a stream right now over on Twitch. And we'll be giving away Crusader Kings 3, the base game, and some of the DLC. If you want a chance at that or just come by and have a good time, then let's go do that. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Until next time, bye-bye.